know what this place is. The timekeepers have built quite the circus. And I see the clowns are playing their parts to perfection. The timekeepers. Big metaphor guy. I love it. Make no one Wilson. Smart. I am smart. I know. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Please sign to verify this is everything you've ever said. <laughs> what? Sign this too. <laughs> wow. We protect the proper flow of time. You picked up the Tesseract breaking reality. I want you to help us fix it. Why me? I need your unique Loki perspective. Oh my god, I love this. Oh my god, dude. I like I knew this was coming, but like this is even better than I expected. Luckily he believes in himself enough for the both of us. <laughs> it is adorable that you think you could possibly manipulate me I'm 10 steps ahead of you <laughs> you're not big on trust are you dude the music you can trust me Loki I've studied almost every moment of your entire life you've literally stabbed people in the back like 50 times <laughs> why never do it again <laughs> Wow. Wow, dude. Wow, 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 wow. Okay. Okay, so, like, that's definitely what I was expecting, but that's also not what I was expecting. Like, I, I don't know what I thought it was going to be. Like, I knew that it was going to be, like, Loki joining this timekeeper kind of organization, and wow. Like, that was mind-blowing. Just, like, the just that one scene where he's like, please sign here that this is everything you've ever said. And then he says one more line, and he, he adds something to the pile, like... That was mind blowing in itself. So, like, this is obviously going to have some crazy, mind bending themes. That it's going to probably be hard to wrap your head around a lot of the stuff. I know that, like, every time they do time travel in in movies and TV shows, like, they have to come up with some crazy explanation. Or like, Endgame probably did it best because they were able to just sort of like be self aware about how ridiculous it is and how hard it is to explain. And then you can only think of it in terms of like your cultural understanding of it and like what you think about time travel like when you saw back to the future for instance and they even mentioned that in endgame so it's going to be a difficult thing to pull off to be able to explain all of this and like keep you know regular people who aren't trying to like have their minds like blown and bent they just want to like watch an entertaining tv show but like there's obviously no shortage of like the sound effects and the explosions and all of the fast action and great things we've come to expect from like marvel movies but like thematically going from like wandavision which was like mind-blowing in its own way and now we're watching falcon and the winter soldier which is like very grounded loki this is clearly going to be going right back into the crazy and like even like and then some so buckle your seatbelts, everybody this is going to be intense i can't wait for it this got me even more excited now i'm probably most excited about this now of anything that's coming out um marvel related i'm definitely excited for the bad batch don't get me wrong i'm a huge star wars fan so i'm you know that's what i'm most excited for but right now loki wow that that just got my hype level from like a like a like a 10 to like a 11 so hey man can't wait for this if you guys are excited for this let me know let me know what you thought about this trailer in the comments below don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you next time bye